indeed. It's going to be King of the Hill, and it's going to be our uh, next. Nexus, yeah. Uh, I think they played that earlier. I'm not sure if they're replaying it now, but... Uh, and quickly... Uh, yeah, I think we're going to see uh, Countdown Team Slayer here. It is going to be Countdown Team. Is it going to be Team Slayer? Because we... Yeah, yeah it, it, looks, it does look like it, so my map list is a little bit skewed. I think we're going to see Countdown Team Slayer here, and if it goes to the next game, it'll be Oasis King of the Hill. But... Uh, I can't see it going any further in this game. Let's see uh, what happens in this game. You're going to see a lot of balcony control. You're going to see heavy, heavy uh, focus on the rockets. It's all about, Countdown TS is all about the rockets. Come control them, you control the map. Mm -hmm. Especially, yeah, that, that, that rocket spawn on the inside. But if they can actually can keep in control of the high ground, and they, yeah. if they can make sure that nobody is going to pick up the rockets, at least the West, if, if Western Wolves can make sure that Apex cannot get close to those rockets. They can't, yeah. They should be fine-ish. It's, uh, it's easier said than done. Uh, uh, you're going to see uh, a lot of fight for the top control. We're going to see, uh, gonna see um, Balls Deep Halo really, yeah. You're going to see everyone fighting. Everything's on the line. Well... It's definitely on the line for the Wolves now because <laughs> we are ready to go. And Slayer has never sound that beautiful. We're on our way and the rush is on. Let's see what they can do here on... Okay, oh, there it is. Oh, dear. Yep, that's already on the pickup. That's a shame. You can see Stefan MVP burn that there. The OV, the way it works now is if you pick it up while you're weak, you don't get the OV. You, you get invincibility for five seconds and you get nothing. So good shots by Scott to make him burn it. He backs off one time. We are once again taking away from Apex Fusion here. A player who managed to play so, so well in the first nine to ten minutes of the previous map on Zealot CTF. However, then, then the slope started to kick in something happened something happened on the apex side and well it all crumbled from there on we'll see whether or not it's going to happen this time because the momentum is definitely over on towards western wolves but is it going to be enough fusion can he get here on mvp will get himself another one but will be ripped to shreds right there you'll see apex take an early lead at eight four i think we're gonna see uh fusion lifting up the band there helping his teammate out and getting some good shot oh, i thought he shot the wall there but he got a kill on baxter Fusion shooting walls and still managed to pick up kills. I uh, did manage to get his beat down in, but you can see a team shot. His team helping him clean up that person. Mm. Well, I think he got away. You know what? If this is the kind of ma matches that you see in MLG all the time, then I'm so sad that I was not born an American. Because <laughs> now I'm finally getting riled up. Let's take it away. Fusion on the double. Yes, you will. No, well, never mind. On the revenge. But that's going to be very painful. And the Rockets will be coming up soon. Speaking of MLG, this uh, Apex lineup's looking to go to Columbus in yep. March. If uh, they win. If they if win. If they win. Uh, I, think, I think that's uh, going to happen on this Western Wolves. I've got something to say about it. But I think we're going to be seeing uh, Apex at the Columbus uh, in March. And hopefully they can uh, set some boundaries for Europe. I hope. Uh, I know top eight's a goal for Europeans, as it's never been done before. But... Uh, Hopefully they can do that and can do some serious damage. Fusion, ready to go. Map trying to control the map. It's 17 to 10. Make that 18 to 11 as the extension is being made. Adamski once again trying to go in a 1v1. Is it going to be enough? Yes, it will be because Fusion will pick that one up. No, it's going to be an assist actually as Buck 20 comes around, gets himself another one. He's on a killing spree. The Buck brothers are coming through. They're gonna be, yeah, they're gonna be bro fisting up there. Oh, hello there, Baxter. Welcome to the, welcome to the game. Baxter's gonna be winning mm. that one. That's an important battle. Got a little bit of team shot, but Baxter's having a good event as well. Playing him earlier, we're the best player on his team. We're gonna see what's, uh, what conspires in the next five seconds as Rockets are gonna be dropping. There's the Adamski S2, he's gonna be taken out. Baxter as well. Where's the Stefan MVP on the Rockets? He's gonna be taken out as well. Big play from right there on S2. Apex so far in the lead, 24 to 16. Will we see the Western Wolves come back like they did on the previous map? We have seen them do it versus SK. On SK, they managed to come back to uh, three, the uh, two to three uh, for a while, and all of a sudden picking up those matches, maps back to back, getting caps back to back. Previous map, we saw them play so so well. Absolutely astounding. Went 4-4, four 4-4 four four with finally getting that fifth. 
And Baxter now finally had themselves the Rockets, but not doing too much with it. A six-pointer difference right now in favor of Apex, and it's still... They know, they know they're in a difficult, they know they're in difficult uh, waters right now. Yeah, they know the Baxter against the wall, that they're playing, uh, they're playing, they've got nothing to lose. They're only five kills down now, the, the lead was a little bigger, but uh, we'll see if Western Wolves can close, see if can maybe take a game. Good clean up there by Fusion, that's an important kill. I think we're going to see a guy in Apex's balcony, but they're not too fussed, they're just going to leave him. Oh, I'm not sure if he's still there. We see OV coming up in the following second, maybe next five seconds. Is that some team frag in there? I think it was Fusion. That were a good bait by Pete. Pete managing to take two players off guard there, getting his team an extra two kills. We're going to see his Apex do control the overshield though. See what they can do with this. Overshield is coming in. They're trying to maintain the high ground, trying to shoot down. There we go. Revenge comes in. Can he get the double? Yes, he will. Can he get the triple here on pistol? Not going to follow up on that one. Still in the pre-fire a little bit there. Yeah. Let's see Fusion staying alive on Lodor, dodging them nades. He's got a nine kill lead. He's got he's got death to play, but he's not playing. He's staying on low. He's not he's giving he's keeping his shields. The final is definitely coming down to this. This map here, Team Slayer. If the Western Wolves win this, they may, and that's a big may, have that momentum to go on and possibly win this series. I find it personally highly implausible that it's going to happen. But after seeing them play on Zealot, after seeing them play for SK, if there's one team at this LAN event that can stop Apex in their tracks, then it's this one. Pistol, yeah. 1v1. We'll pick that one up. Good play here with 20 and Fusion. Buddy system, rock and roll. Here's a fusion sitting in top drop. We're going to see the weapons dropping in 10 minutes. That's Sniper on Snipe 2 and Rockets on the Lodo. These are going to be a huge turning point if Western Wolves can control these. Controlling the balcony is very well here, so you're going to see maybe the Rockets in control as all of Apex are forced onto Snipes out of the map. Yep, you can see there the Rockets are actually not there, which means Western Wolves have got them. That's going to be huge if uh, Western Wolves want a chance to bring this back. You can see the league only close to five kills now. Thirty-five to thirty. Ooh, that's a, could be a two v two right there. That's As, a good uh, spot by Fusion. As you can see, they pick up the overshield again. That's uh, they can trade kills at this point. Although it's not, it wouldn't be the, the first time to see a countdown team slash slip away. EGL four. Uh, I remember a similar situation with the exclusion. Uh, oh, oh, big backs, Mike. But I don't think uh, it's going to slip away this time. I, I don't. It's not going to. It's not going to stop the momentum that no, is going on here. Well, they're saying that. They're only four kills behind now. We're going to see his Western Wolves. But there's a snipe. <laughs> oh, that's a big kill. And the Rockets down. You that's a critical... Oh, sniper rocket combo. Yeah, oh, baby. Let's do this. Let's do this. That player may have just sealed Apex the win on this event. All right. Two Rockets. That's too much to play with. And there is a snipe and the Rocket. Seven kills extending the lead now. See what they can do with this. No, nope, definitely. Look, he's just got that sniper out. He's looking for them scopes. He don't care. He's going to try to pick this up. He's got all the he's firepower gonna be, in the world. He's going to be picking up the spawn, and he's going to be going top goal. Let's see if we can get a cheeky kill. Oh, he's definitely going to try to go for it. This angle is a good angle. He can pick up a few unsuspecting uh, players on the back ramp. Well, you'd think, you'd think Western Wolves would immediately make the call. There's the first. Baxter will drop. One rocket remaining on the second. Never going to hit anything that. It's on the snipe. Going to so follow up. We're going to see five kills away from uh, winning this event. Make that four. <laughs> Almost free. My heart's shaking. My heart's beating. And here we go. DMR and Snipe. That's a big kill by Will. Let's see what... Oh. You see two, three people go across outside there. Three more bullets. Three Four, kills away ten for Apex. Minutes. 13 for West It's Wolves. not going to happen. That would be the comeback of a lifetime. It's it just not going to happen. Let's see as uh, it comes down to that nail biting moment. See any kills taking place there? Western Wolves not really poking out. They know they've not got many kills to play with. They're going to be playing the same. Nope, One more, kill. and there it is. Fusion will pick up the last frag here by Apex, and that will be the last frag they will need in this series to win Reflex GT Season 8 for Halo Reach. Wow.
What a final. Quite a final there. We see... Uh, uh, I see my mate tweeting at me there. Uh, we see... Uh, that's a good final. Well played to Apex. Congratulations. Well played to Western Wolves. They were the second best team at the event. Mm -hmm. I'm sure... I'm sure they're going to bounce back. Uh, and of course, thank you to SK Gaming. Yeah, a, bit, a big shout out to SK Gaming. Uh, looking after me this event, I really do appreciate it. Mm -hmm. As uh, in the meantime, production, can we quick take a quick look at the stats if they're currently running up on towards the side? See what is going on in Fusion. I'm not even looking at the stats. He's, he's he is. He's he knows what's going on. He's standing up. He's a, he's he is he's giving handshakes and high fives to his teammates. He is. He's won his fifth event now. There it is. There they are, on their Right. Apex managed to pull it together. And even though they managed to, yeah, they only needed six maps in total out of this best of 11, picking up every single game they needed to. Three maps back to back. We only needed, team, uh, we only needed a Team Slayer, a CTF, and a Team Slayer. And that, as they say, it is that. Ramirez, I want to thank you so much to, uh, for this grand final. Oh, it's well. been an absolute pleasure. Thanks for having me. It's no, been, uh, no problem, it's been no problem. Fun. And be sure to check out the YouTube page where all the VODs are going to be thrown up. Well, thrown up is a little bit of an annoying word. Uploaded on towards the website. It's chaostv.nl slash YouTube. And in the meantime, you want to win yourself a mouse mat? Yes, we're giving mouse mats away to unsuspecting console players. Go to uh, our Facebook page, which is Facebook slash... Actually, slash, yeah, that's that slash, yeah, yes. And go for Chaos TV. There's a post there. Hit the like, throw a comment on there, and you will automatically sign yourself up to win yourself a wonderful little mouse mat. And that is pretty much this. Halo's not dead, gentlemen. Halo lives. We're going to be back soon with some last-minute interviews and, of course, the surprise ceremony where we're going to be showcasing our winners for this tournament for Reflex GT. In the meantime, we'll be back with you very shortly here from our studio. My name is Acebeck, and that's Ramirez. See you shortly.